Grace, you can see behind me, there's quite a bit of water flowing through that ice. And that's why firefighters are so concerned that this is going to happen again, because the weather has just been so warm. The rescue happened around noon today when a man who was ice sailing fell through the ice. A bystander nearby tried to go in and save him, but he ended up falling in the water too. Fire teams then went to rescue both people. The fire chief says the person who first fell through the ice was in the water for upwards of 40 minutes. He was brought to the hospital after suffering signs of hypothermia, but that bystander was not transported. The fire chief also said if that bystander hadn't been there to go and help that man, this could have turned into a recovery, not a rescue. Earlier today at the lake, many people were still ice fishing and skating on the lake even after the rescue. Some of the things that people should do is they should always check the ice. Never, um, you know, never go out without a chisel checking as you go. Just because it's safe in one place doesn't mean it's necessarily safe in another. Um, you want to go out with somebody. You don't want to go out on the ice alone. And if you do fall through the ice, officials say it is critical to keep as much of your body out of the water as possible. Live in Jaffrey, Ariel Metropolis, WMUR News 9.